Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got the Square Hue Ballet Collection and I'm going to do a smishy then I'm going to stamp it. I have started this manicure off with Nail Ticks Formula 2 and I've got this Milani White. It doesn't have a pretty name, it's just called Milani White. I had to pick it up because Sylvia over at Hell of a Nails talked about it. So, you know, I'm still on the hunt for my favorite white and this one's not it. <laughs> it's a good white. It's just, I'm looking for like the holy grail of white polishes. I have tried so many brands. This one ends up looking really good. I mean, it smooths out really nice. I'm just not a fan of white polish. So, I'm going to top this one off with some Posh Top Coat. I need it to dry down before I do my smushy. I, you know, I did two coats of the color, so I want to make sure it's good and dry before I try to start doing that smushy. I don't want to mess things up. There I go, capping my end. I'm going to apply some liquid latex that I decanted in an old Sally Hansen, uh, I think it's the Complete Salon Manicure line. It's got a really nice fat brush, and I love it. It works great for applying latex. I got a big old tub of that stuff off of eBay, and it's so nice to put it in a little bottle with the brush. There we go. Got them all ready. And here are the Square Hue Polishes. Allegro. Pure Wet. And Aperesque. And I'm going to use this Starry Scamper, Stamper from Born Pretty and this little mat that I just picked up today at Walmart. It's really cool. I love it. It's over in the Clarence section. I love stuff that's on Clarence. But I wanted to go ahead and get a manicure in with these before my next box shows up. It ought to be showing up just any day now. I've had so many new polishes come through that I'm having trouble <laughs> using them all before I move on to the next ones. And I didn't want these stored away in a drawer without ever being played with. So I wanted to make sure I got in my monthly square hue manicure with the box that I got this month. But these were really pretty colors and I really didn't know what to do with them at first and thought about doing a gradient and I decided to go ahead and do a smushy. It's been a little bit since I did one. I'm just tapping that stuff on there until I get it, you know, in a way that I like. It's no rhyme or reason to these smushies. They kind of like water marble. They kind of have a mind of their own. They all turn out different. It's a very messy, messy manicure. That is why I'm so happy to have on that liquid latex. gorgeous colors. You guys know I'm a square hue polish junkie. I just love their polishes. And these were really, really pretty. There we go. I'm going to peel off this liquid latex with my little handy dandy tweezers. Having a little trouble with it. It's getting stuck. But it's all okay. You're going to get it. There we go. And now for some cleanup with my Sonia Kushak Tools number 27 brush and some acetone nail polish remover. And we're going to top this off with some posh top coat because now that we've done the smishy, we're going to do some stamping. It's very pretty all on its own, but you guys know I've just got to take it one step further. Kind of hard to see with the lighting, and but in real life, it just really did shine. I'm going to be using this You Are Beautiful 01 plate, and I'm going to use these circles. The Nicole Diary NS04 Silver Polish, my Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper, and my Fabernail Scraper. I'm sorry about that pink lighting. I've got a nightlight looking thing on my lamp, so it got bumped. I'm looking like I'm at a disco. And tap, tap. We're going to do a little bit more cleanup. And I assure you guys, this is not a posh top coat 
commercial. It's just I had to do many layers of it this time. In fact, I'm going to skip it on this. I'm just going to do my cleanup. So there we go. There's my final manicure. I hope you enjoyed this one. Leave me a comment down below. I always love talking with you. That is all I have. Thanks for watching. And until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.